The success of Better Factories Cambodia leads to the launch of Better Work. I'm the Global Program Manager for the Better Work Program, which is a partnership program between the International Finance Corporation and the International Labour Organisation. Work starts in four new countries, laying the foundation for a global rollout with the highest level of international support. Buyers are at the centre of global supply chains and have a strong interest in improving labour standards. Better labour standards means greater productivity and safer, more robust supply chains. In 2008, Better Work launches its buyer principles and the world's largest garment manufacturers begin to sign up. If you are looking at it as, as a, uh, you're just looking at the cost of, uh, if we invest in better labour standards, um, if you're just looking at the cost of doing that and not looking at the benefit, um, I think it's the wrong way to look at it. Our view, our strong view, is that the benefits outweigh the costs. The monitoring system is another layer of audit which is uh, conducted by the ILO in Cambodia. Several buyers have decided that they will rely on the ILO monitoring and this is a plus for the manufacturers in that they no longer have to be subjected to multiple audits uh, by different uh, buyers for the same elements and the same items uh, on the checklist. I think one of the greatest achievements of this program has been to pull the different partners together and uh, the acknowledgement of the parties that this kind of uh, multi-stakeholder dialogue can actually truly benefit and help the industry to prosper. Everyone agrees that this has been central to the program's success. ILO is the recognized global leader in labor standards and labor issues. And combining those strengths with IFC's core strengths of private sector development uh, really enable us to deliver a, a comprehensive program. My opinion is that the ILO's Better Factories Cambodia project has helped the union representatives and leaders to understand the labor law and to help us resolve problems. The training we've received has helped us to create strategies to find solutions and to negotiate according to the law that governs the garment sector. With the help of the ILO's Better Factories Cambodia program, we now pay more attention to human rights, medical treatment, hygiene and security, the working conditions for our workers at the factory. The ILO has helped us to build a stable environment. We work as a team, and all the team members work hard at this factory. Managers, supervisors, employees and the unions are getting closer and working more harmoniously. Effective management, efficient production and high quality products increases our business by generating more orders. Better factories is an unprecedented scheme that you have not seen anywhere in the world before. We were the first to initiate that scheme so to make sure that there is transparency, but at the same time there is a kind of a system to encourage buyers to place orders in Cambodia because of good performances of the factories that they are outsourcing. That's the reason why better factories come into place. The government pay its shares, the US government also pay its shares. We involve also the private sector to pay their share. Now what is very good is that even the buyers start also to join hands with us to continue with this project. I think this is a kind of a role model that Cambodia is playing to make sure that labor compliance is going to be a brand name for Cambodia. Better Work's rollout continues with its new country programs. Each program is adapted to the national circumstances and its specific labor needs. And Cambodia is still leading the way. It'll be the first country program to become self-financing and independent. The others will follow. Thank you.